Why do 70% of partygoers leave Diddy's events in shock? Imagine this. A night filled with endless champagne, women in barely their outfits and a sense of exclusivity that only a few could breach. Diddy's infamous parties, often dubbed satanic parties, went far beyond the ordinary. Upstairs on the balcony, hidden from most eyes, were rooms of secrecy and scandal. Only the chosen few were allowed inside. Downstairs, the scene was no less shocking. Naked bodies and sex workers everywhere. One attendee even confessed, I saw people in lingerie. I saw live sex happen that night, but it gets darker. Reports allege that drug consumption was rampant, fueling the chaos until the early hours of the morning. And the most harrowing detail? Some guests were allegedly forced into extended sex acts with male commercial sex workers. Federal prosecutors have now stepped in, accusing Combs of running an enterprise involved in sex trafficking and other criminal activities. Just weeks ago, Combs was arrested on charges of sex trafficking and racketeering. Prosecutors claim he and his associates threatened, abused and coerced women, forcing them into recorded sexual acts to fulfill his desires. This isn't just a party gone wrong, it's a scandal of unimaginable proportions. Stay tuned as more details unfold.